Have you got that all done? Great. Now, let's have a look at what we've got here. We actually, we're in index.html. That's a web page. And this is showing us the hidden code inside the web page. I want to run this. And if yours is already set to Chrome, that's great. But mine here is going to run this on its internal browser. And today, I don't want that. So we're going to change that. We click on the small little arrow to the right of the planet Earth. I choose Chrome. And now I'm going to press the Run button. It's saying that I don't have the NetBeans Chrome extension installed. It's no problem. I just go to Chrome Web Store. I add to Chrome. Add extension. There we go. Now I can close this down. I can go back to my NetBeans. And if I like, I can just press that button. And now we will see up here to do write content. This is our web page, the index.html. I want to make one slight change to it. So I'm going to go back. And where it says down here to do write content, I'm just going to go this is my first web page written in NetBeans. Stop. Run that again and make sure there you go. This is my first web page written in NetBeans. Okay. Those of you that already are set with Chrome and that works, away you go. For anyone at home who is having issues with this, if it's not coming up with the content, can you make sure in your Chrome settings, if you go to the Advanced tab and Network Settings, I'll take you there. So, onto Settings, open the Advanced tab, and then you need to go to... Network, change proxy settings, and under your LAN settings, please make sure you have bypass proxy server for local addresses if you are running a proxy server. Okay. Right, off you go as well.